I believe I saw the fist bump, so we may be going straight into game one. Yes, and honestly, before anything big happens in the game, I just want to mention I find it so funny when people ban only to go back to PS2, and <laughs> that's exactly what happened. But here again, another Yoshi, another Yoshi from Long Island. All the Yoshis dwell in Long Island. That is their home. Yoshi's Long Island. Yoshi's Island. And not only uh, another Yoshi, but another Yoshi versus a zoner matchup. And I'm very interested to see how this set will differ from the last one. Mm -hmm. And um, Zane's Duck Hunt is a force to be reckoned with. Zane, um, yeah, I'm seeing um, for most of the match, or at least in their first couple rounds, um, Zane was using uh, Daisy and Peach and now bringing back the Duck Hunt, but Suarez just pushing Zane away, not letting them back onto the stage, and they're just like, God, that's it, that's the stock. Mm -hmm. uh, we're seeing Suarez uh, really just in Zane's face a lot so far, but you up, up air gonna be able to catch Suarez trying to take the high road. Yeah, and um, Duck Hunt in general has a lot of setups. And when you know Zane is just putting down these things, something is going to happen. But Suarez is just able to avoid them, especially Quinn coming back onto the stage. Suarez at 140, and if we saw the last game, Yoshi's just not going to die now. Mm -hmm. Especially no rage. Just got to give it a hot second. Yoshi need to lay some eggs, sacrifice its left it's life for Mario, and Ooh, then it can take the, the dog. sheriff coming through. Right, and now, um, relatively equal-ish game. Ooh, we're seeing a lot of damage being put on Zane right now, though. Zane, Zane not getting all of the uh, the space to set up the uh, the cans or the the goons that they want. Ooh. I think was that a was that a DI mix-up? Uh, just barely crossed up. It looked like. Mm-hmm. And now Suarez. I love how Suarez is just navigating their way around Zane's um, cans and Sheriff, especially when they're stuck on this side. Suarez always manages to find a way up. But right now, Zane is doing such a great job at just pushing Suarez away. Suarez is just not allowed back onto the stage. There's only there's no what's that West Wild Wild West line where it's like there's not there's too this many town ain't big enough for the two of there us. There we go, that's the line. <laughs> and that's exactly what Zane and the sheriff are trying to do. But the roads have switched and Suarez is now just pushing Zane away, not letting them back onto the stage and and that's not a place that Zane really wants to be at, especially when Suarez was at a, a really high percentage. But now he's into his last stock. So something I've been seeing quite a bit lately or in this game is Suarez making use of the eggs to fight his way through the can. And really because uh, it switches the way that the can is shot when Zane presses the B button, B button again, uh, it's forcing Zane to manually intervene with his can sometimes, while Suarez is able to make a clean getaway to the ledge. Mm hmm especially when both of them are hit like that. Um, Suarez is able to just recover back so quickly, just find a way to get back and let that unfaze them. And now um, Suarez exact knowing exactly when to run away and not to get so close, especially when the can and the sheriff are both out on the playing field. And Egg is even even good against the goons uh, because they have the sort of different animations when they're hit that I believe take longer than if they were to, you know, just shoot and then go away. Mm -hmm. Both of them at almost a hundred. Both of them. Ooh, F smash! Gonna be catching Suarez's landing. Really, really good play on Zane. Zane was really able to just find a way around Suarez's play. And we just saw Suarez just pushing Zane away, not letting them back onto the stage. But finally, Zane able to catch it with a forward smash. Look at that. Pa, pa, pa. Yeah, and you can see Suarez not happy about that one. Suarez was in control for almost the entire game. Zane just barely able to bring it back. 
and uh, looks like we're going to be taking it right back. I completely agree, agree with this from Suarez. Like I was saying, he was in control for so much of the first game. You know, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Exactly. And here, oh, Zayn back at PS2 already won the first game. Enough momentum for them to keep going on already at 63, 70, 80, 90 percent into Suarez and barely 20 seconds into the game. Oh, looking for a, a frisbee combo. Suarez just unable to get closer. And the only time Zayn is actually taking damage is if they're taking damage from their own cannon. There you go, that back air. That'll be it, I think. Suarez taking a minute to compose himself, it looks like. That little taunt maybe for motivation? I don't know, something. Maybe. It was uh, shield flashing, it looks It looks like. Hmm. But here, Suarez still not giving up, still doing their best, trying to use those eggs above the platform, trying to like shoot right above it and so that they could avoid all of the sheriffs and all of the um, cans. <laughs> Get that can out of here. Oh, very nice. And that that is a, a morale boost if I've ever seen one. That didn't look like it was going to spike, but it, it just went straight didn't. down. I don't even think it made the noise. Yeah, it, it like threw me off. I thought it was just a normal. Mm -hmm. OK, well, Ooh, there we nice go. Nice can set up. A classic Zane can set up and something sometimes so hard to die out of, sometimes so hard just to get out of and now that it's in the radars Suarez has to keep it in mind mm -hmm. and I think we're seeing Suarez uh taking it a bit slower oh that could have been a, a jab reset but Suarez taking it a little bit slower now after that first stock he was just running into so many different projectiles I think maybe a little bit impatient after the results of game one but uh stock two now Suarez taking his time getting the pants off that goon Ooh, yes, Can Can attacking both of them. And now um, Zane's method of edge guarding is so interesting. And there we go, there's that <laughs> he shield. He had to be careful of the can. He was, he was sitting in shield for just a second, waiting to see if Zane had any tricks up his sleeve. Right. And then, right as the F smash went around, that's when the can jiggled a bit. So now the onus is on Zane to get Suarez's second stock. No rage on the board. Can not going to be doing it quite yet. Ooh, Ooh that up there could have been it, but the can trading will do it. Still very equal on the um, board. Suarez still a full game. Um, Suarez really needs this game to stay into winners. And we see Suarez just really just struggling to get close every time they get a chance to. They get a little bit um, phased. But especially in this game and the previous stocks, Suarez has been doing a really great job at just finding a way to avoid the setups. Mm -hmm. And I think I can see a little bit of the frustration coming through. We saw a little bit before uh, Zane had a Frisbee just sitting in front of the ledge. And Suarez just kind of had to respect that, uh, had to give up a lot of space before, uh, or for the ledge trap against Zane. Yeah, and honestly, the can um, has the potential to, to attack them both, has the, has the potential to um, explode on both of them, and that was such a scary oh, setup. Oh, this could be it. Well, no, just back here to get Suarez off the ledge. I really love these up tilts uh, on the can. It's actually uh, very sneaky because it changes the direction of the can to uh, the opposite side. Uh, ooh, normal get-ups into the can! Yeah, Zayn at such a high percentage and Suarez at such a high percentage. You really don't want to get close and there you go. Zayn really just using projectiles and as you should against a Yoshi that's so up in your face. You just don't want to get close, but... yeah. Obviously, both of them played incredibly well. Zane really adapting his play style so that Suarez can actually... Um, so they can read Suarez's um, choices and moves and adapt whatever set per set combo they have. Mm -hmm. All right. And it looks like we're going to be seeing a caster swap here in a sec. But yeah, um, really good play on Duck Hunt and Yoshi. 
Um, really good on all the players we saw today. Absolutely, I had a, I had a great time.